Welcome back, fuckers. All right, today we're gonna quickly run through Zuni rockets and how to use them, what they're good for. So come into your loadout screen and you've got a couple options here. So it is a rocket, so we're gonna scroll on down to the rockets here. So we've got options. So we are after this one here, Brew 33, two Lao 10 for Zuni Mark 71. So we can fit double Zuni pylon or double Zuni rockets per pylon. So we can have eight, eight per station equals a lot of bang for your buck so that's the one we want rockets zuni okay and then you've got the other one brew 33 lao so if you just want a single zuni pod which is only four four uh, rockets per pylon you can take that or you can double rack them so up to you so we've got double zunis on that is what they look like all right so we've got a lot of uh a lot of missiles rockets keep calling missiles air to ground rockets unguided but they're pretty accurate using the CCIP. So now we're going to quickly get in the air and I'll show you how to use them. See you in a sec. Alrighty guys, we are back in the jet. We're in active pause right now, but quick run through. So you select air to ground mode, our Zuni rocket, the stores paid is 10S. So we're going to go ahead and select that. You've got options here. So CCIP, manual, single or salvo. That's the options you've got for this. So we're going to leave in CCIP mode, which is going to use the uh, our targeting computer to designate or tell us when to fire said rockets. Um, you can go on manual if you want, but just leave it on CCRP, okay? And then the other option we've got is single or salvo. So single will shoot one single rocket every time you press the weapon release. Remember, air to ground is weapon release, and air to air is your uh, gun trigger to fire said weapons. So single will just rotate, so it will fire one zuni out of the, uh, the apple pile in there then it'll switch to the next and the next and the next so every time you pull the trigger or sorry press uh, weapon release it will fire one zuni and then rotate through each station the other option is salvo so what this is going to do this is going to shoot one zuni rocket per zuni pod so we're going to shoot all right one two three four all the way through to eight so we're going to shoot eight rockets in one pass okay so one rocket will come out of each zuni pod on each station so for this current configuration we've got now it will fire eight zunis at once kind of overkill you don't really need to do that with a zuni uh the other rockets yes you might be more give you a bit more bang for your buck but the zuni is pretty powerful so we're gonna leave it on single and we're gonna go ahead and go shoot some things so our ranging reticle same as the gun as we get closer that's going to start unwinding once we get in range it will say in range and we can effectively fire all right so as we roll on in they're not uh, super super accurate so wait till you get fairly close to fire one of these so we're going to pick out this guy here all right that's our guy we're going to put him Put our pipper just below him and then as our range cue continues to roll down it's going to say in range we're going to get closer and closer and closer the closer you are the more accurate it is and there we go want to wait and we missed did we miss we did we missed good times all right so there you go not super accurate but lucky we got 31 more 31 more zuni rockets so you can see there that's our quantity there we've got 31 more rockets left so that's okay we're all good let's roll in and have another one so it's depending on the wind conditions if you've got wind turned on in the server or the server's got wind i should say uh it will affect your rockets so you've got to kind of just have a look wing it do what you got to do so we did hit him but we didn't kill him got splash damage on let's go for this guy right on the uh, piano keys of the uh, runway Altitude. roll Altitude. in again and open away it's probably gonna drop short as well yep drop short so we're gonna shoot just in front so that's what it kind of looks like at the moment so far, we're having a uh, sweet run of not hitting anything. But hey, this is going to happen. Can't be on god mode for everything. 
Here we go. Roll in. See if we can hit one. Come on, baby. This is how shit normally goes for me. Alright, this guy here. Piano Altitude. keys again. Altitude. Wings level. And... Now that's got to hit. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Yes. We got a shack. Lovely. So same rules apply when you're uh, doing ground attack. Try and mix up your... Uh, entry and exits as in don't come in from the same side every time try and mix up which side you'll sweep in from so that you're not as predictable always a good habit and pick your target early get yourself in altitude let's go again fire and then pull off target Otherwise, you'll get smacked. Okay, there's another shack. We've got our iron now, boys. Got the iron. So that's how you do it. That is Zuni rockets. And so we'll go one more. We'll put it on selvo mode just to show you. So now we're going to fire eight. Eight rockets in one pass. So our quantity is 28. When we press the weapon release, we should be at uh, 20. 20 rockets remaining. So who's going to get it? Who wants the eight Zunis? I'm going to give it to this guy, because we missed him last time. That guy right there on the piano keys of the uh, dummy airfield. You, sir, have deserved it, because I missed you on the first one. If we can't him with eight, well, you deserve to live. Last one. Altitude. Selvo mode. Altitude. Boom. Yep. Ruined his day. There we go, fired eight, <laughs> eight Zunis off. That was super overkill, but got the job done. Anyways, boys, I hope that helps. If you uh, haven't used Zuni rockets, very, very good for just doing general uh, ground target destruction. A bit more bang for your buck. You can carry way more uh, than the eight uh, dumb bombs, and they're just as powerful. Like, we're hitting BTRs. One well-placed Zuni rocket will take out a BTR. Not sure about a tank, but it'll definitely make its day not good. So, good hitting power. You can carry a heap of them. And you've pretty much used them like you would with a gun. So, if you did like the video, make sure you go ahead and hit the like button. And if you haven't already subscribed to the YouTube channel, we just bumped over the 200, 200 uh, subscriber mark, which is awesome. Didn't think I'd get that many. So, keep them coming, boys. I appreciate it. Helps me out a lot. And last but not least... If you haven't already, jump on over into Twitch. Uh, I stream there Monday to Friday at 1300 Australian Western Standard Time. And yeah, come on in, say good day. Give us a follow there if you uh, if you like what you see. And come in and watch DCS shenanigans go down. Right, guys. Catch you fuckers on the next one.